Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, my name is Theria, and um, today I'll be doing a full guide on how to play Floor of Frenzy. So, um, if you don't know what Floor of Frenzy is, it's a Roblox game with over two million visits, and it gets and it, and it's kind of dead right now. So, um. Today, if you want to play, I'll make a full guide on how to play. So first, I uh, so in the beginning of the game, you'll get earth and water, an earth and water seed, which which is pretty good. And over here, I, um, I got a a sea a sand plant. In the in in the game tutorial, you have you have to make um earth and water. Close the door, please. Never mind. All right. And usually you have um like a fer like a tier seven fertilizer, um which you have to use forcefully. But um I don't have that right now, so I have to wait painfully for for this to grow. Now, now once it grows, um, you hop it. Let's go. You harvest it with this scythe. Um, once it grows, but let me show you. Let me tell you about the boat. The botany. The botany is like the index of the like a like the collection of which combinations you can do which which seeds and plants you've already got and yeah so let's say earth plus sand equals rock earth plus fire equals poison earth plus poison equals fungi 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 soil plus luna equals eclipse we will get to that later but um i think you get the point and um once you got your sand plant, you can harvest it or you can keep it there and you can get your own sand seed. And um, this water bucket just makes you water plants. Um, and this shovel, um, which, which doesn't show you in the tutorial, I don't think. You can you can move plants to different areas, so yeah, I think that's cool. And um, that's the basics of the game. Now let me tell you about like it, it what the game doesn't really tell you about, like how to get coins, and and maybe I can show you some glitches. Cause why not? Um. So. So to get so there's a couple of ways to get coins. The first way is to harvest, is to harvest a plant, which you'll get like twenty to thirty coins. But I but that's not the fastest way. Once you're already, once you're already like mid game, um, you can go over here. Um, and and go to the sell deposit and you can sell and you can sell stuff uh, uh, according to the to their prices so yeah now let me now let me tell you about the hub like this area of the game so as I already said there's a seed deposit where you can sell where you can sell um, seeds the homewares um is where you buy different houses and different ores for your farm walls and roofs which i'll get to later the seed store is where you buy um the generic earth water fire and air but you can also buy some um Robux plants or if there's an event um there'll be a seed over here so right now we've got the glitched and gemstone um seeds they both cost 15 robux so yeah and and the final area we'll get to later 
But now let's talk about the house. So the house is in it, it. The house is like a secondary area. If you just want to wait around, you can. What if you have a lot of coins you want to waste? Then the house is for you. Um, usually, noobs get like this area to work with only one floor. But if you're, but if you're like free to play, um, the highest you can get is two two floors. But um. I spent a bit of Robux on this game, so I got the mansion and got the third floor. And um, yeah. So you can buy like different decorations by clicking this. Um, a lot of things cost different coins. And um, the most expensive item in the game, I think, is the golden seed, which um, I already have. So, um, yeah. And let me show you a Robux exclusive area. So this is the greenhouse where you where you get to keep the all of your all of your precious plants that they can't really get anymore. So over here I got the Phoenix and Starstruck. Both of them I traded for. Um yeah. Now, and also, the house, the homewares is the stuff where, like, um, it, this, this has a larger area, this has a second floor, like I said, and, um, these ores, um, go around your, go, go around your farm or garden, whatever you want to call it. Um, for it to look cool, like this. Yeah. And next is roof color. You can set the color of your roof on top of the house. Like lime. If I wanted to equip lime, I could. And if I wanted to make like my wall color, my roof, like ocean or something, I could. Yeah. Let me just switch it back. Alright. Now let's talk about like it, what what happens? It, what the lunar and solar plants are. So the lunar and solar plants. This is the lunar. This is the solar plant. And um, to get them, um, you need to get um meteors, um, which which early in the video um I collected. Um, like they look like white. If they're like white things in the sky that drop down and just stay there until someone collects it. And um, it, I'm pretty sure it expires. But um, basically, h how you get the lunar is um, if if you. If you plant the media seed at night, you'll get Luna. But if you plant it when it's a sun, it'll be it'll be um, solar. And um, there's actually a combination that you can do. If I can find it, there we go. Solar plus Luna equals eclipse. It, so if you combine the Luna seed and the eclipse seed, I mean the Luna, the Luna seed and the solar seed, you'll get the eclipse seed. Yeah. Um. All right. Now let's talk about the the chances of everything. So um, high high chance means like nearly guaranteed. Good chance is like fifty fifty. Medium chance is like like twenty five percent of the time you'll get it. And um, low chance probably like ten percent, and 
and probably the most um, time con and, and probably the most time consuming plants for me for, from my experience is Rainbow Galaxy and Black Hole because it took me like 15 days in total like a, a couple hundred seeds just to get them I know my luck isn't great but um yeah now let's talk about um the values and stuff of different plants so if you're talking coin value you can simply just um go to this go to the seed deposit and you can see the coin value of it so like air is like um twenty dollars black hole is fifty thousand dollars diamond is like one thousand dollars yeah it says it. my most valuable plant um opal is one hundred thousand dollars which um which is how i got this many coins and for opal you need to spend money on the gemstones here, here we have all the gemstone robux plants um so there's bronze silver gold diamond emerald sapphire ruby and opal opal is a rainbow version of all of these yeah and um that and there we have the glitches we have the code glitch the i'm gonna just try and remember through this this one is the streak glitch this one is the lime glitch this one is the sunset glitch the void glitch the static glitch the distorted glitch and and uh, my rarest plant um and the rarest plant so far in the game according to badges on um, the the um the spec the spec spec forgot Um, so yeah, uh, oh yeah, this is a specular glitch, um, which I think it looks cool if you go farther from it. It, it, it looks like it's just a black one, but yeah. Now, um, let's talk about probably the last thing that you need to know about the game before like fully going into it is the trade hub basically the trade hub is is an area where you teleport to to the trading plaza there's like a trading place and um basically you click on another person like click or tap on him or her and and there should be like a thing to tell you like if you want to trade with this person you say yes and and you can trade I'll put up some pictures now of how it should look like so yeah um yeah I think that's all you need to know um, before fully going into floor frenzy So yeah, if you like this, um, I, I can I'll do more Flora Frenzy content in the future if you guys like it. And who knows, maybe I could do like a like, like an advanced players tutorial because as you can see, I'm pretty good. Um, yeah, all right. So um, I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.